Here we have straight leg hamstring stretch, utilizing active isolated stretching as our tool where I'm going to be using my, a rope to assist myself. And again, I do have a towel because I'm going to be doing this from a laying down position. The rope will wrap around the, just the arch of the foot is fine. I'm going to go ahead and roll back place the towel under the nape of my neck. My stretching, my non-stretching leg is going to stay bent. My stretching leg is going to be straight. My leg, the action itself is you're actively lifting the leg straight up towards the chest, keeping your knee straight. This is, this is so important to keep that knee straight. How do you do that? You have to contract your quadricep. So we're lifting and then we're assisting by gently pulling overhead and releasing. So it's straight leg hamstring. We're stretching behind the leg now. We've stretched the calf, behind the knee, the lower part of the hamstring. Now we're getting into the upper part of the hamstring. So we're getting, I'd like for you to inhale, actively move the knee or the leg up towards your chest and then gently assist as we exhale. Hold this stretch for two seconds and then we let it release all the way to the ground. Let the contraction go. Inhale, lift. Exhale and release. If your knee starts bending and your back starts lifting up, you've gone too far. It's all about the quality, not the quantity or how far. And release. Inhale, lift. Now your foot can be gently flexed or gently pointed. The important part here is keeping your knee locked or the quad tight, okay? Inhale, lift. Exhale and release all the way down. Inhale, lift, exhale, and release. So notice with the hands handling the rope, I'm just kind of going hand over hand, getting it out of my way, and release. Let's do three more together. Inhale, lift, exhale, and release. And guess what? I'm still stabilizing by bracing my center. My center is still working and release. Let's grab one more together, please. Inhale, exhale, and let it all go. With these eight to 10 or 10 to 12 repetitions on both sides, and I cannot emphasize enough, make sure that your rope is just your tool. It's not the mode of how your leg moves around. Use good breathing with this. 10 to 12 reps, and you'll be on your way.